Angela. Also topping our news tonight, uh, two men now in custody in connection with the overdose death of the mother of nine in Middletown. Local 12's Larry Davis broke this story today at noon and he joins us live from Middletown with the latest on the case and how the community is still working together to help the woman's family. Larry. Hi, Paula. Well, two men are locked up tonight here at the Middletown City Jail. They are, uh, they were arrested rather this afternoon on Verity Parkway at Old Oxford State Road. And both men have been charged in connection with the overdose death of a mother of nine children. 63-year-old Jim Boyer and his son, 32-year-old Keith Boyer, face nine counts of child endangering and one count each of theft, abuse of a corpse, and tampering with evidence. Police say they were with 31-year-old Jamita Sanders when she died of a drug overdose Wednesday night at her home on Yankee Road in Middletown. Her nine children, ages 1 to 14, were home at the time. Police say the Boyers left Sanders there and made off with her money. Today, donations continue to come into the Middletown PD, filling the police training room. The response to a call to help the family was overwhelming. Things came in all night, overnight, and we came in this morning. There was more stuff out here, and people were just constantly just giving and giving, and um, it's just it's overwhelming. It's more than what we thought it would be, not even comparable. And uh, Paula, Chief Muters Paul says that one man came up to him, just walked in off the street, said he didn't have a job, and gave the chief a $5 bill. That's all he had, he said. And another group actually donated $9,000, $1,000 for each child. And later on today, we'll hear from the father of those nine children who says now, after what the Tri-State has done for his family, he wants to pay it forward. Live in Middletown, Larry Davis, Local 12 News. Paula, back to you. Thank you for that, Larry. And to learn what you can do to help the family, you can go to local12.com.